Hey guys, Poor Owl here, and today I'm going to be showing you three spots in Thousand Needles that you can AoE farm in as a Frost Mage. If you're unsure where to go around level 30, hopefully you can find a spot in this video that works for you. If you're looking for a specific part in the video, you can find timestamps in the comment section below. But I don't want to waste any more time, so let's get this started. The first location is in the southeast of Thousand Needles, and is a really great spot for mages level 33 and up. In this location you'll find a bunch of bugs that are all close together, which makes it easy to pull for a group kill. I was able to train here for a long time uninterrupted, and I'm on a high populated server, so I don't know if nobody knows about this spot, or if I just got lucky, but this spot is a great place to go at level 33. I tend to get groups from 5 to 9 mobs, but one thing you have to be careful for, is if you aggro a bug that's near another bug, you'll also aggro the ones around it. I try to use this to my advantage, and pull as many bugs as I can, so you'll have to find what works for you. If you've killed all the bugs above ground, there's a cave right in the same location with two more groups of bugs that you can kill, so this place has plenty of mobs that can spawn for nice AoE farming. The next spot is located in the north of Shimmering Flats, and is a nice place to stop by and get some good experience. All around Shimmering Flats you'll find sparkle shell tortoises, but in the north is a spot where like 15 turtles hang out, so I like to run here and AoE them down. You will probably kill all the turtles in two poles, but that actually leads me to my next spot, which is pretty much going around Shimmering Flats and pulling random groups of buzzards, turtles, and scorpions. If you see the Crystal Pine Crocolisk, I would avoid them, as they can mana burn. But when I run around Shimmering Flats, I'm able to pull groups of mobs ranging from 5 to 9 mobs, and this is just an alternative to sitting in one place and grinding for hours. I've had good success AoE leveling in Thousand Needles, and would definitely try these areas at level 33 and above. The next spot is insanely good, and would definitely recommend coming here at level 31. This spot is called Dabairi's Farmstead, and is an AoE experience gold mine from levels 31 to 35. This area is filled with more mobs than you can handle provided there's nobody else farming here, and in my experience, you can get a good amount of time here before any other mages or questers come to the area. There have also been times where I've come here and there was two other mages already farming here, so you may have to get here at the right place at the right time to farm. But as you can see, pulling 8 mobs plus is never an issue if you're alone, and I've managed groups as big as 11 mobs here, so it can be pretty insane. Okay, the last place you've probably seen already, which is why I just made this a bonus spot in the video, but Scarlet Monastery Graveyard is a great place to farm for experience, gear, and silver, and I farmed here for a while to gear up my mage, and see what the experience was like, and would definitely recommend coming here at level 30 to test it out. Here's two upgrades I got while farming in here. Last night I ran Scarlet Monastery with four mages and a priest, so you don't even need a tank to come here. Just a group that knows how to line of sight, and Frost Nova massive groups of mobs to avoid damage. You can farm Scarlet Monastery Graveyard from levels 30 to 35, or even 36, before moving on to farming Scarlet Monastery Cathedral, which I'll cover in another video coming soon. Alright guys, that's it for now. Hopefully you found something useful in this video. I'll be covering more spots for higher levels soon, so stay tuned for that video coming soon. If you'd like to watch me live, you can catch me at twitch.tv slash poorowl, where for now I'll be leveling, but eventually AoE farming for gold, and ranking up in PvP once available. But for now, thank you for watching, and buff those around you.